All right, Kanye 91 rated striker take Chelsea to yet another channel win. No! So in my last video on my creative player series, I created Yochi Isagi from Blue Lock and I put him in Chelsea because their kit, their um, third kit really, really resembles the Blue Lock trading thing. I played a full match with him and I really, really enjoyed the match with Chelsea. So I want to see if he can actually, um, as a 91 rated um, striker, I want to see if he can actually take Chelsea all the way to the Champions League finals and win it at that. I replaced Newcastle, so we are going to be in the group of death. This is legit a group of death. They have PSG, Dortmund, Milan and Chelsea. There is no room for mistakes in this group stage. So let's Let's see if we can go all out here after like take out two major teams from this tournament and go into the round of 16 ourselves. This is what the squad looks like. Isagi up top because he has 94 pace, 95 shooting, 90 passing, 94 dribbling, 44 defending and 69 physical. I guess that's why he's like 91. Um, 4 star skill moves, 5 star weak foot. I really haven't watched Blue Lock. I've only watched like the first 4 episodes. But I feel like Isagi is going to be like, you know, he's a main character. So obviously he's going to be like a really, really good player. And um, 91 just feels like a very, very decent rating for him, I guess. And then I'm putting out the best possible lineup. I don't think that was Silva I said in Chelsea in real life. But I mean, he's here. So I'm going to use him because, you know, he's at 84. Um, I also use um, Chalobah a lot more than Thiago Silva, to be honest, and maybe put in the Sassi a little bit more because uh, like they're younger, more agile and shit. So I want to just see how well Thiago Silva would do in this first match for me to like determine if I will be using him or not. All right, the first match is going to be against AC Milan and this match is going to, I'm going to play the full match of it, but like I think the rest of the group stage, I'm probably going to do like simulations and playable highlights and shit. But I want to see how well the team can actually like uh, measure up against this this kind of a group stage so um yeah let's go to the match ultimate team sorry ultimate difficulty five minutes and uh let's see if we can get the win here all right so i'm playing with the long ball and possession let me just turn this thing off real quick i forgot that the guy is still talking all right like i said my plan is to hold possession and try and see what i can do here that was a very good pass from isagi a very very good pass from isagi but um, um what's his face sterling wasn't able to like put that away Okay, I see you. Give it to Sterling. Bro, oh, that was that would have been really close. That would have been really close. What am I doing? Why did he why did he do the fucking skill there? Alright, Rafael Liao is one person that's going to be like a major problem with this um Milan team. Alright, let's see. How to attack possibilities. Get to Kopama. Get it to Isagi, who will Pop in and try to shoot didn't work out as, as planned but we still have the ball i think yeah we do all right if Kongo is through our goal for Palma. we're able to get a shot on there the defender was able to get a good block on and rafael Leo, exactly his pace is a fucking nightmare oh my god it was that easy for him. It was that easy for him. All you had to do was like run around my defense. Thiago Silva is not the best person at all to counter that pace, to be honest. So I think I'm going to have to make a couple changes in the second half because I can't have that. We've had like majority of the possession like mad. And that is not just the start I'm, I'm looking for, to be honest. All right, Enzo Fernandez. Looking good here. But I do not know what to do. Let's just turn back. Nice. Yes, in Kunku, Gallagher, Sterling, and it's a good shot, match for the save, but we're, we're gradually getting up, we're, gradu we're gradually getting there. I think Isagi is yet to have a shot on goal, I feel like this guy is going to have, I mean his shot power is insane, so I feel like he's, he's loaded up a freaking bullet in the back there. I'm going to try it, oh shit, oh my god. Alright, nice, get this to Isagi. So Kuku who will make a couple. Alright, it, it didn't work out. But we are still with the ball dude. Let's get this out to Enzo Fernandez to go Palma. Who will get this to Kuku? Who oh my god. I mean we just can't get that final pass on. I just can't get it off for some reason. Alright, the second half and I'm still like a go down. But we're looking to be in a good position here if I can get the cross out to Cole Palmer. It's not a very good idea, but nah, it's not a very good idea at the end of the day. But my issue is that I cannot get past the defense. 
like legit and i have something absolutely insane that i want to do here so i don't know if this is going to work at all or it was a deflection i don't think i wanted i wanted isagi to be at the end of that but i have no idea what happened there I don't even know what happened there, just like switched off, the defense just like fucking switched off completely and they've scored a goal. Okay, that is good. Alright, it was, it was, it was a good um, run from Isagi. He tried to go into load, but like um, the final shot wasn't good enough. Especially with the fact that he used his weaker foot up for that. All right, this could be another chance. Oh, oh my God, that was actually good. Good from Palma and a good shot from Isagi as well. So I'm not going to go um, straight in. I'm going to go short with this. Get it back to him so that I can pull up a madness right now. The keeper does well to keep that out. All right, let's see. Okay, that is brilliant. Thank you. All right, so that's the first goal. We just need one more and we should be good. We just need one more goal and we should be good. Because like I, I'm okay with drawing the first match, to be honest. Because, I mean, look at the freaking the freaking um table. Milan, Dortmund, and PSG. So, I'm okay with drawing the first match. PSG is probably going to be the toughest out of all three. Oh, Mbappe is no longer in um, PSG in my save. So, um, I, think, I think we should be good on that part. All right, that is just great. Is that police safe? Celebrating against your own club, I see. It's not nice. Well, it turns out that we are going to lose the first match. It turns out that that is going to be the case. We started so well, but uh, what's his face? Yeah, Rafael Leal was just like a pain in my ass in this match, to be honest. Because, I mean, the Chelsea defense is just not good enough for this side. And that is going to be a red card, isn't it? It's a red, right? He wasn't the last one, so I don't think... Oh yeah, it's a yellow. Alright, all right, definitely. I feel like they were definitely going to get out of that goal there if I didn't do something. So, oh shit, it's a penalty. What? Okay, that is actually kind of insane that we are able to like... Not concede there. Okay, get this Kopama. Isagi. How do I get what you are doing, bro? But anyway, that's 3-2. We are not going to be to be winning this match. I mean, if we did not concede that last goal from Pulisic, then this would have been a draw. I mean, I was so confident in the draw. But after that goal, it was just like, bleh. It just went down the fucking drain. There's just no chance anymore. It's, it's, it's long gone already. Look at him. He just let him go. What? All right, so we lost the first match, 3-2. It was a good match. We started really well. I think I just need to, like, get used to the Chelsea team, like... A lot better than I, I currently am right now. And Isagi did... He wasn't really on the ball a lot because the defense for um, AC Milan was really, really good. But I feel like we still have a chance to like, go out of this um, group stage. So let's hope that that's what we do. Next up, we have PSG. And this is going to be another tough match. I'm going to be putting Thiago Silva on the bench. If I really, really need him, like if I need fresh legs, I will bring him on in the... Oh, you know what? Let's still leave him on. No, 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 he's the reason why uh, Rafael Leal was actually able to score that first goal, like legit, he's the reason why. And uh, I'm going to bring Kunku to the bench, I'm going to play Nonimaduke up there. Nonimaduke, say like a fucking Nigeria, bro. I'm going to play the highlights for this, and let's hope that we do get a win against PSG. Mappe is no longer in the PSG squad, if I am not wrong. It shouldn't be as tough defensively as it should normally be. Oh, what do you know, he's actually there. <laughs> He's actually fucking there, so um, I mean, yeah, we are in for it. We are in for it, and we are starting with a freaking solo run, and the Mbappe is like literally like in on goal. What, bro? This is crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sanchez did so well there. Oh my freaking god. I can't believe we actually escaped. And right, they have another chance here, and I feel like this is just going to be like chance after chance for them all right so learn for us and i think isagi should be able to 
Do something here. Please score it. Oh my god, you don't fucking score it. How don't you score that, Enzo? How does it Enzo score that? The thing is, I actually don't know who to like aim for in this Chelsea side. So I think I'm, I'm just going to bring in Palmer. Get it back to Isagi. Go far post. Oh my god, that didn't work out. That didn't work out as planned. All right, Chelsea counter attack. Um, Isagi is looking like this is going to be a re oh shit, 82 minutes. All right. Please score it. Thank you. All right. I don't think we probably would have like one more chance or they will have one more chance after this. But uh, if we have won this, that is going to be insane. No, we haven't. Course number two is about PSG in the 86th, 87th minute. And I have to defend this with my life. I have to defend this with my fucking life because. I mean, why not? <laughs> if we get the ball here, we're probably going to like come up with a come up with the with the counter attack. How do we not get it there? What? I swear to God, this game is. Oh, okay. All right, so we do end up winning the match one 0 There was no counter attack, but I mean that was a really really good run from Isagi to get the goal. And I think that's two goals in two games for him. And um, that is one win. One loss, one win rather. And let's hope that the next match against Dortmund is going to be yet another win. I'm going to be going for the same lineup I went with in the first match apart from Chaloba and Cho coming in for Silva and um, Kukurela respectively. I'm going to be playing the highlights for this one as well. We have a win, we have a loss. Um, I really need to win this one. We're at home. Were we at home against PSG? Yes, we were. So we really, really, really need to win this. And I really hope that that's the case. All right, so they have a counter attack up first and we should be able to hold this they aren't they actually haven't gone that far they're going to like hold hold, hold up the ball okay no counter attack i think we get the ball here are we going to come out with the counter attack um the fact that sancho is here Marlin is here they have a a lot of really skilled players that is a really good save from um sanchez and we have an attack all right so it's a normal attack so we have to like calm down think about it hold the ball and let's see if we can end up um with the ball in the back of the net okay get this out to isagi can we get this to him and all right he's offside he's offside i wanted to actually give it to him because he was in a better position to shoot because he, you know he's a uh, left-footed and it just wasn't the targeting was kind of off i mean it was really hard because there were two players there all right so we have an attack and this is going to be in a really really promising position um the you guys have subbed out uh what's his name Isagi for some weird annoying ass reason like how the fuck are you even going to do that what the hell and i would have a, a counter attack i want to win this i do not want to draw this so i don't know what jackson can actually do here but it's not looking it's not looking very promising at all to be honest well um, can sterling actually go through oh please score it oh my god Oh my god, no! Oh no, my god! Oh no, 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 no! That was so close! That would have been so good! That was so good from Sterling! Alright, Palma! Alright, that's, that's pretty much the end of it, right? Yeah. That was so good from Sterling! That is so unfortunate that we weren't able to score that! <sighs> so that is a, a loss, a win, and a draw! great next up we have the second leg of the match against dortmund i'm going to be simulating this one i don't know why isagi got summed out in the in that last match that's actually rather annoying i'm going to leave Thiago Silva in this because he is uh i'm not going to be physically playing the match I, I really wouldn't have a problem with it i'm going to bring in caicedo for Edo fernandez i'm going to leave the rest of the team like that and let's see if we can get a win here against Dortmund. We actually don't. Chowell scores. Hokum scores. So yet another draw against Dortmund. So I need to look at the table real quick to see exactly where we are and what we have to do. And which teams we have to get past. We are currently third. Milan is on crack in this. They've only lost one. We have to beat PSG. We have to beat Milan to be able to do something here. So if we beat PSG, we will be um, on eight points and they will be on six. Yeah, so we absolutely have to defeat PSG in this last match. So that's what that's what I'm going to play now. And I'm going to hope to God that um, Dortmund actually like can hold Milan. Oh, uh, Fofana has a red card, so I'm going to be bringing in Chaloba in for um 
for him. And then I think I want to play the Sassy over Thiago Silva here. Oh, you know what? That's not a very good idea. Let's just leave it at, as it is. Obama is going to start in the middle and I'm going to bring in uh, Mikhail Modric. Modric rather and I'm going to like switch up with Sterling so this is what we're going to be doing for this match Sterling is going to be on the right for this the Blues are going to clash I think this is the best that I can work with here so this is a must win match because if PSG beats us in this match that is our Champions League dreams over there and there to win the Champions League with this team is a stretch to be honest like on paper this team is not Champions League winning material so I'm going to like push and push and push we started really well in that match against Milan let's hope that we can like emulate what we did in that match in this one but this time don't consider any goals Mbappe is going to be here as you can see and uh it's going to be tough yes but I feel like we should be able to hold him at the back we should be able to hold him at the back so Chelsea come on you guys got this let's see what you can do okay that is good but Chelsea so Sterling wasn't able to like do anything with that but we do have a free kick in a very, very interesting position. Usagi has really, really insane free kick stats. So, this should be good, shouldn't it? This should be good, but I don't think... Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so it was actually a really good free kick, just unlucky. Do we have another one? Oh, no, we don't. All right, that is Mbappe's first shot on goal. All right, can we release Sterling? Then release Isagi. What the hell was that? What the hell was that pass? Come, what the fuck is this game sometimes? All right, calm down a little bit. All right, Kaba. Oh no, no, that was actually really good, but we just weren't able to like finish. All right, so they are inching closer yet again. I swear to God, Chelsea is like trying to make me run mad in this. Oh my God, what? Oh, that was, that was close. All right, so we have... A good chance here to get Cole Palmer through. I think this should be a goal, right? Oh my god! What? I'm beginning to think this is rigged. I'm beginning to think this is rigged because what the hell was that? What the actual hell was that? Like that made no sense whatsoever. So now we are we're trailing yet again in the match that we we absolutely must win. Like how? I have to go absolutely aggressive in this. Oh my god, that is a rocket. That is a rocket. Oh my god. Bro, and it wasn't even a power shot. So imagine if I use a power shot with this guy, it's going to absolutely obliterate the keeper. What? Bro. Keeper had no freaking chance. That is one hell of a goal. What the hell are you telling me? That is crazy. All right, so we have equalized and that is exactly what I need. The team is looking like we actually have what it takes to like grab a win here. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Oh, he's through. He's through and he scored. Okay, that is two, two one, two goals for him as well. And that was really quick. That was really quick. At the end of the first half, that is what I'm talking about. So right now, I just need us to like hold this lead. I was not expecting him to get past the defender because I actually wanted to like, I actually laid that pass off to Modric, to Modric rather. He was in the right place at the right time and he was, he's good enough to like put that away. Oh no, oh my God. All right. So the first half actually like went by really, really fast after that last goal. And um, yeah, we just started the second half and we already had that. Like that is a fucking nightmare. I don't even know how the hell I'm supposed to defend stuff like that. Because, I mean, the jockey just... Oh, my God. What? 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 That was crazy. What the hell happened there? All right, I was really lucky there, but I'm going to be bringing on um, Vecchoa and Nkunku for the Calimondrick and uh, Cabrera, respectively. All right, so Sterling is through on goal here. 
Maybe he's going to score. He does. And that is an assist for Yoichi Isagi. He is taking the reins this match and showing PSG that he showed PSG and Mbappe that he is the star man in this match. Good finish from Sterling. I actually wanted to like lay it off to Kuku, but um I remember I had that cover and I saw him. And I mean the best thing to do was just like shoot and hope that Sterling doesn't pop it up. And he did it. So 3-1. All right, so we are absolutely lighting them up in this match, and I and I love it. I'm living for it right now. Yeah, that is great. So Kuku, you have the legs for this. Yeah, you do. Kopalmar scores. Thank you. Yeah. All right, so that is four one. We are lighting this motherfuckers up so much, and I love it. That was actually a really really good counter attack. I haven't like had one so sweet in a while. Uh, I'm going to be bringing uh, Kopama off for Madike after that. That is actually a really good finish from him. And uh, that's yet another assist from Isagi. So, two goals, two assists for him. That is good. I would really, really love for him to like have this display of the hat trick, but I never really know. It's not the most important thing in the world, really. So, let's just try and see it off. Am I able to take him off a bit soon? That is a good interception from Sterling. So, right now that we are 4 1 up, I just want to like uh, pass them, really. Okay. Marike. Oh, that would have been the goal of the video, in fact. What? Alright. Okay. Kunku. Fernandez. Alright, so that was just wide. But can we get this out to Isagi? Could he be on for a hat trick here? Boost past him. I think he's all for a hat trick, definitely. There is no way he's missing this. No way in hell he's missing this, right? Definitely not. All right, so that is a hat trick for him. It was coming. It had to come, and it has come. Really, really happy for him, to be honest. That is a really good, really good performance. A hat trick and two assists. That is five goal contributions in one match. That is absolutely insane. So I think I'm, I'm actually going to like take him off. Like, along with... um. Fernandez. So that is a really good match for him. Let him just rest for the remaining five minutes. He has had a really good match. I don't even know why I was like even worried because I mean I was worried about uh, Mbappe and I completely forgot that I had freaking Yochi Sagi in the team. Like I completely forgot about that and you know he proved himself and he was like why the fuck are you forgetting me bro and well Uh, the the play here is sweet as fuck. Damn. Damn. Look at the one touch passing that I did there. That was so good. 6 1 to PSG. This is actually unreal. On ultimate difficulty as well. Don't forget. Alright, so we have the boy yet again. <laughs> okay, so PSG honestly just gave up there. They were so confused at the end. They did not know what the hell they had to do to. Um, stop us to stop Yoichi Isagi because he absolutely lit them up in this match and I really really love that so the next match is going to be against AC Milan the final one I'm not going to play it I'm going to play the highlights I think either that or the play or the I'm not going to simulate it normally depending on what the table looks like all right so this is the table Milan actually did win against Dortmund so Dortmund is completely out um PSG have a chance to um get above us if Wait, if we draw against Milan, yeah, we're going to be through because of goal difference, yeah? And then, I mean, we just have to win or draw, basically. So I think I'm going to simulate the match because I don't think we're going to lose against Milan in our own home. So I'm going to simulate the match and let's hope that, uh, you know, things go our way. And we win it. Sterling gets a brace in this match. That is good for him, to be honest. And I think we're through. Yeah, we're definitely through the round of 16 now. And we are going to be second, so our, our our first match is going to be a, a little bit tough. But I'm going to like either sim. Oh, it's against Bayern. Oh my god. It's against freaking Bayern Munich. Chelsea versus Bayern. That is going to be one hell of a match, to be honest. For me, because that is that is tough. Bayern is a tough team all around. Alright, so here's how I'm going to do it for the knockout stage. I'm going to simulate the first match, and if I need to play the full match for the second leg then I would play it. If I don't, I'm just going to have to play the playable highlights. But if it's a really big win, that I feel like they are not going to be able to come back from that, then I'm not going to simulate the second leg as well because um, I don't want this video to be like extra, extra long. But yeah, we're going to be in the snow. 
We're going up against um what's their face? Bayern and I think they are going to win us. It's a draw. It's a draw. So um I think I'm going to play the highlights because I feel like we have a chance of beating them in the playable highlights. Better that we have a chance of beating them by playing the full match to be honest. So I'm going to put it out here and play the highlights. Let's change the kits because I really really like the alternate kits or like the away kit. It looks a lot like the blue lock one to be honest. So let's go into the match and see if we can get a win. If you guys have enjoyed the video so far make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It's a tough match here. We are off the back of a victory against AC Milan. So we lost only one match in the group stages. That is interesting. So this team is actually good enough on paper like when it comes to like i only see we did one match if i'm not wrong or two and we didn't lose any so i feel like the simulation we should be good so all i need to do is just like back that up with the the performance the performances i make in the match he's going to go short here right i was just like rambling there to be honest i have no idea what the fuck i was saying if i get the ball here it's not going to be a counter attack is it no it's not all right so chelsea attack what do we have um position play obviously that's oh I swear to God, if Isagi makes that run. Oh no, they close they close him down down really quick. Oh no. That is not a good pass from Noni Madike. Noni Madweke. I don't know why I keep on saying Madike. Alright, good. Counter attack. Get this out to Sterling. Get on your bike. Oh. Oh. Gets out to Gallagher. Oh no, the final pass is what is killing me here. The final pass is killing me legit. That was such a good, a good way to keep the ball from Isagi. Like he did really, really well there. Or is that going short yet again? I bet, definitely. And come on, give me a freaking counter attack. All right, so crossing opportunity for Chelsea. So I need, I need to score this. I doubt I am going to though, but I, I feel like I, I, I need to score it. Okay, so... Oh! Oh no! No, 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 no! I should have taken it one time. But he still has a good chance on goal here. His shot power is insane. What the hell, what the hell is that? What the hell is that supposed to be? Oh my god. Like, okay, so like, what was that? I mean, they just gave them the ball for what reason? Brother, this game, this game is on crap sometimes. Alright, so Bayern have a solo run. Um, Kane versus Chaloba, pretty much. Can he cut him off here? He should be able to. Good save from Sanchez. Counter attack. Alright, let's get this out to Cucurella real quick. This game is trying to mess me up so bad. Uh, Sagi, no, perfect. Okay. Can you? Oh, that is a good shot. Good shot, but Nia was able to match it with a really great save as well. So I do not want to go all the way to um the. What do you even call it? Oh my god, that was the wrong person I slid with. What? Okay, this is bad. This is not good. Very, very good from Rich James there. Alright, so we have the, we're at the 80th minute. So I feel like this is our last chance because if we do get the ball here, we'll probably be, we probably uh, what the hell was that? We probably will have um a counter-attack if we get the ball here. So that is my priority to try my best to get the ball here and not concede because if we concede counter attack yes all right so get this out to someone real quick and don't mess it up oh my god i fucking messed it up what oh okay so i'm going to take that i'm going to fucking take that to be honest <laughs> what that was so lucky so, um, it jumped all the way to extra time. I don't think we can go to penalties from playable highlights. So it just like comes up with the results in like the extra time. And we won. 
So we are through to the quarterfinal. That is perfect. I really love that. And uh, I will take that. All right, so next up we have Benfica. It's a little bit easier than the match against um, Bayern. But I'm not going to go with the main team here. I'm going to bring in Chilwell. I'm going to bring in Mikhailo Modric. I'm going to start... Um, hmm... Lissasi for Silva. So Silva is not going to be in this match at all. So let's simulate the match. And let's see if we can get the win. Yes, we do. Isagi and Palma get the goals for the team. Let's look at other matches that have already been played. So Barcelona and Real Madrid actually faced off in the quarterfinals. That is interesting. Barcelona is through on aggregates. Milan is also through against Manchester United. Um, Inter Milan and Manchester City are yet to play. And I feel like we probably are going to be playing Manchester City after this match. I don't know how the thing works on FC24. If it's like the same way it is in real life. But... Oh wait, if it's in real life, I'm going to be playing uh, Barcelona rather. We are 2-1 up, 2 goals up, 1 goal up, sorry, 2-1. And uh, we should be able, we don't have enough available players to fill subs for the next match. What? I'm actually so confused. So, they probably like changed one of my players. So, um, it's 2-1, so the best thing I can do right now, or the, the best case scenario would be, sorry, the worst case scenario that I should be going for would be to like draw this. Yeah, that is not a very smart pass at all. I don't, I, I don't know what I was thinking. But now they have a counter attack. We have to make sure they don't score because if they score, it's going to be game on for them, to be honest. They are in their home stadium, so it's going to be a little bit tougher for me. But I feel like we got this. Good from Palmer there. And well, he just lost the ball after, so there's, there's really no point. They have a solo run. Rafa is another. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, that is a clutch, clutch tackle. Oh my god, I love that so much. I love that so much. That was really, really needed. All right, so they have yet another counter attack. Um, Rafa, yeah, as I was saying, he's really fucking dangerous. Look at that. He is really, he's really dangerous. All right, so that is a good save from Sanchez. And now we have a corner. We have a side on it. So I'm going to. You know what, let's do something really fucking crazy here. Let's do something really fucking crazy here. Come on. Didn't work out, but we still have the ball maybe? Yeah, we do. But it's not offside, right? Oh, it's not. Oh, well, we lost the ball now. I don't know. Okay, so we have a penalty. And you already know what's going for the Panenka. I am going to go for the Panenka. I'm telling the keeper right now. I'm going to go for the Panenka. I swear to God, if he says this, it's going to be crazy. All right, no, he didn't. <laughs> All right, so that's yet yeah, another goal in the Champions League for Isagi. And he's actually flying. He's actually looking like he's able to take Chelsea to... Oh, my God. It's not going to make a difference if they score, right? Because we're still going to be one goal up. So, um, Sanchez has already saved one in this match. And come on, I died the right way. I died the right way. What more could I have done there? I have like positioned the keeper correctly and I still died the right way and he still scored it. Alright, so that's the end of the match and we are through. 1-1, one, one. we scored a goal. It was a penalty and we also scored a penalty as well. So, um, we're going to the semi-finals though and we are going to be playing against either Barcelona or Manchester City, I'm not sure. Let's see if Manchester City did win their match though. And they did. 4-3 on aggregate against Inter Milan. And let's look at who we are going to be facing in the round of, sorry, in the semi-finals. Milan. We are going to be facing Milan again. And City and Barcelona, I didn't even think of Milan. And they, they, they beat us before, yeah? But I don't think they're going to beat us again because I'm more in tune with the team now. I'm going to simulate real quick. And hopefully we do win it. We do win it. We do win it. So I don't think I need to play the full match. I don't even know who scored there. I just saw the 2 0 and I was really happy. I don't think I can check who scored though. But yeah, I don't think I can check who scored, sadly. So we have the second leg against Milan. And I'm going to be playing the highlights, obviously, because we are 2 0 up. And I don't think that they can score me three goals in the highlights because that's just not possible. So. I'm going to make a couple changes real quick. I'm going to bring Palmer to the center, bring Modric to the left, starting to the right. So this is the formation that I use to destroy PSG. So I don't really, I'm not, I'm not really expecting to do um, as well as I did there, but 
I feel like the Champions League finals is going to be against Manchester City and that is going to be a pain in the ass. I mean, Barcelona is also a really good team. I don't know I don't who won their first leg. I didn't check. I wasn't really interested. Because they're both teams I really didn't want to play in the Champions League fucking finals. So, why did I swear there? I don't know. Sorry about that. But anyway, Isagi has done really well. Really, really well. I think he has scored... I don't think he has scored 10 goals, to be honest. But he has done really well. And... If he if I was playing all the matches, I probably would have scored to 10 goals with him, but I'm not. Alright, so this is the last match before the finals, and we are leading 2 0. We have a course of Marquise, and I said before that there's no way that would score me 3 goals to nail in this match. There's no way they get a 3 goal um, lead in this match. There's no way. And I feel like I have already jinxed it already because now they have a fucking penalty, and Rafael Leal is on it. I'm going to go left because I feel like he's going to go left. Oh, my don't have guess right every single time, and he does a fucking character. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so let's go first. Rafael Leal is the bane of my existence, and look at this, they have a freaking counter attack. They have a freaking counter attack, this is crazy because, I mean, there's still a lot of time for them to like, equalize, and then probably score another one and win. But I guess at this point in time, you can obviously tell if they won the match or not because of the timing oh my god that is just dumb thank you <laughs> thank you for that all right so they have yet another attack they are they are really trying to kill us they're really trying to do that they're, just, they're really trying to make it possible obviously he was going to shoot there good block from um Fofana though get this to Cucurella. Sterling. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much for that. So we are one all, and we are back to like a three, a two goal deficit, three one in aggregate. And Isagi did really well there to like slot it past my non. Who oh, then gets it to Isagi who make it cross, and that didn't work out. Why did it not work out? All right. I mean, we still have the ball though. Come on, come on. All right, so we have a slow run. This is really good. So, Isagi has a chance to make this a brace. He's quite a brace against uh, them in the last match he played, didn't, didn't he? So yeah, bro is scoring like, like, like water. He's scoring back to back to back to back to back, and I love it. I love it for him. All right, so they have a solo run. So there's no way that they are going to be like beating us in this match, to be honest. There's no way. Because, I mean, we, it's a three goal deficit right now. There's nothing, there's nothing in this world that they want to do. That's, oh, we have a counter attack. So we, we could probably, this would probably end up in a goal, in another goal. Or, I mean, we're just going to win it that way, isn't it? And that was actually really good. That was actually really good, but it wasn't able to end up in a goal, but we did do really well in this match. 2-1 in both matches. And now we have the Champions League finals to play. And I do not know who that is going to be against though. Manchester City and Barcelona haven't played their second leg yet. So I think it's going to be against City. And no, but Barcelona actually did beat them. 2-1 in aggregate, that is good for Barcelona. So I mean, it's still going to be a tough match. Barcelona is actually really, really crazy on paper, to be honest. So, I really don't know what I'm going to do here. I'm going to try my absolute best to make sure I come out with the win. Isagi nets brace as Chelsea beat Milani. I already know that. And uh, yeah, the last match is going to be against Barcelona. It's going to be really tough. I think this is going to be the best because I don't think... Yeah, I mean, I could... I want to use this one. But Barcelona... You know, I think I'm, I'm just going to use this one. And then I'm going to give Barcelona this one. Or this one. Yeah. Because I really like this one and I want that to be the key I want to use for the final match. Alright, so I'm going to be making a couple changes. I'm going to bring in Kuku off and then play Modric. I'm going to do what I basically did in that PSG match because I really, really liked what I did there. I really liked the way um, the team was when I, I, I positioned them the way I did. I'm going to leave Fernandez on though and I'm going to start um, Chalobah. Wait, who is... Are they really fast people? They aren't really that fast in Barcelona like their wingers. And uh, I think I'm going to be good with this for now. But I'm going to bring in... Definitely, definitely going to bring in Kuku in the second half. And Madike as well. So, 
Well, wish me luck. Let's hope that we do get a win in this match. If you have enjoyed the video so far, make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And let's go into the match. All right, so Isagi has been able to get Chelsea to the Champions League finals. And this is going to be one hell of a match, I feel like, because I really want to win. So we're going to be going all out. We are put my, my possession play so far in the matches that I have played, like the full matches. I think it's the third full match I, I would have played in this in this video. But like my possession play has been actually kind of okay. So I mean Barcelona is the worst team to try and do that against because like their possession play is also really really fucking good. So I mean let's just hope that I can do something in this match. I come out with a win. Oh my god. What is that? Come on, get the ball back from him. What was that pass? And how did how did he even get the ball back there? That is crazy. Perfect. And we cannot hold the fucking ball. Oh my god. That is a brilliant save. That is a really good save. Alright, so I deserve to like concede in this match, to be honest. I deserve to concede because I have no idea what the hell I'm doing in the first 15 minutes of this match. I have no idea what the hell I've, I've, I've been doing. Alright, so let's try and sit the fuck up here what how did he how did he just miss the an entire ball how did he miss it okay this is actually pissing me off okay i have no idea what i tried to do there but that was another really good shot from isagi all right so magic has been on some crack in this in this half i don't I, I really don't i'm not a fan of what he has been doing so far to be honest all right i think i just boost past oh god all right so we could have played that but the game is fucking stupid so okay because sterling oh my god all right so sanchez has done an absolute madness in this first half already like, I, I really like what he has done so far. He has saved a lot. He's really, really saving my ass here. Oh, God. Of course. We deserve to concede a goal like that. We deserve to concede a fucking goal like that. Because we've just been doing absolute stupid shit. And it's, it's, it's well deserved, to be honest. It's well deserved. But we need to sit up. We need to sit the fuck up. And get back to this match. We cannot have gone through what we went through in this video just to lose here. So... Come on, guys. All right. Can we score it? Oh, my God. Oh, my fucking God. He did not have any any bit of chill in him there. That was a fucking rocket. Bro took his time and then blasted that. Keeper had no chance. I look at the fucking net, like the way it rippled. Keeper had no chance with that at all. So that is 1-1, one, one. Isagi yet again, saving Barcelona's ass, and, uh, sorry, saving uh, Chelsea's ass. Alright, they have a good chance, um, they also are really good in the air, so I need to, I, I need to sort that out. Alright, so second half, sorry, first half is done and dusted, we have done not great, but Isagi was able to, like, give us that sliver of hope in the at the end there so let's hope that we can actually turn this match around all right so modric is not doing as well as i would have liked him to do in this match so i'm going to bring in maddie k i'm taking him to the right put sterling on the left and let's hope that changes a few things uh, that's all the changes i'm going to make for now i'm going to take off power like late on if i need to for Kuku, obviously okay so we have like way more possession than they do in this half and i feel like we need to do something with that okay score please you cannot okay that's cool do we still have the ball yeah we do get this to palmer get it back to palmer can he do something here no he cannot oh but we still do have the ball though Oh, and how do we not score there? What? Oh no, oh no, gets out. Thank you. Okay, can we get this to Isagi? 
No, we cannot. Can we? No, we cannot. And yeah, it was good defending from Araujo, basically. All right, they are looking like they are in a very interesting position. Because James is dead. Oh my God, what, what have I done there? What? This game is out to fucking get me, to be honest. Let's just switch to play real quick. Perfect. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh my god. I can't believe we're actually safe from that. Alright. Let's. Let's do something here. Alright. What the hell? Come on. Alright. We have one more chance. And it's been gifted to us, really. And. He's going to score it. Oh my god! He doesn't score it! He doesn't fucking score it! What? You have got to be kidding me. After everything that he has done in this video, he doesn't score the final opportunity to seal this. You have got to be kidding me. You have got to be freaking kidding me with that. Alright, we need... To I just need to calm down. I just need to calm down, really. Okay, one minute. Come on. Oh my god, he scores it! He fucking scores it! Oh my god! Of all goals he of all goals to score, he freaking scores a header. A 5'8 Japanese guy like him scores a freaking <laughs> Oh my god, I wasn't expecting that in the slide test, but I will take it. I will take it. Final. That is the final um, touch of the match. And he freaking lobs the keeper with a freaking header. That is just like the, the best ending to this. <laughs> what was the funniest ending to this? But that is, that is magnificent. All right. So I think we have won this. Definitely. So just kick the ball and it's over, right? Definitely. So. 2-1, we have only lost one match out, the very first one against um, AC Milan. So, as it turns out, a 91 rated player called Yoichi Isagi from Blue Lock can take Chelsea to, uh, can, can take this Chelsea team to another Champions League win. Absolutely insane that he did that. On ultimate difficulty as well, I played only three full matches, I played a couple playable highlights, I saved like three. Well, I seem a lot actually. So, <laughs> right, so at the end of all of this, Conor Gallagher is going to be the one that is going to be lifting this amazing trophy, and Isagi is going to be right by his side because you know he's the best player in the team right now, and he has done really, really well. Um, I really wish we faced Manchester City, so it, it's been like a reenactment of what happened before. But there you have it. Chelsea are the Champions League winners for whatever year this is, when a Korean guy called Yochi Isagi is going to be like that is, but. <laughs> I don't know if it's happened obviously, but like, really good match, really good tournament, really, really good games. I really enjoyed myself. This was just for fun. But if you guys have enjoyed it, make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Let me know in the comment section what team you would like me to do next for something like this. And uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.